this chapter, folks, I call it question-based dialogue. Ask a better question, get a much better answer. So if you're in the sales field, like we've generally, most of us pretty much are, and as you know, I come out of a retail and um, real estate background. What I did learn early from a few very, very proficient and great mentors is that question-based dialogue is extremely important. So how do you do this? I made some notes on this. Question-based dialogue provides you with a better understanding of what the desires and the wants are of your buyer. So that, to a certain extent, is what I call profiling. Profiling is getting to know who the buyer is, the purchaser, etc. And no difference when you go into a Bunnings store and one of their super salesmen, or even JB Hi-Fi, and one of their super salesmen start asking you questions that could be about earphones or whatever it might be, and they'll ask you a myriad of questions to see what quality or what type they think will best suit you in relation to what your needs are, whether it's audio, music, et cetera, et cetera. So they're the sort of things that I'm talking about. That sort of stuff relates to uh, nationality, how long have they been in Australia, if they're, if they're a new immigrant, um, where, are they, where do they live, have they lived in your family for a while, do they have children nearby, are they looking to buy in an area to stay in your family connection, or are they looking for a school? Those sort of questions are very, very prevalent. And what I think will happen, especially for your real estate agents that watch me, is you need to get intimate contact with your buyer, and that's when you can go through ask them a better question, get a better answer when you've got connection with them. And what, you know, the old philosophy of get a buyer in a car and do a private inspection, in my opinion, is still number one. That is still one of the best ways to understand the needs of a buyer, get closure with the buyer, get success for the vendor, and keep the property on the market the least amount of time.